channel is about fun and sharing everything I know. It's my fashion and beauty world. <laughs> and yes, yeah, you're invited too. and beauty this episode is going to be a product review swatch and dupe guess what it is yes it is the very very popular lip kit kylie yes the liquid lipstick bottles that she launched a couple of months ago i love this color if this wasn't a kylie jenner liquid lipstick I would have still bought it. The color is so rare. It is so, so, so very pretty. I just thought to myself, yes, 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 I must have it. So I'm very, very fortunate. I have a lovely, generous, understanding, compassionate husband who said for me, <laughs> <laughs> uh, the liquid lipstick bottles come in this little beautiful box let me just put it in front of you here I don't know whether you can see it yes but you know the drill you know do do da da and of course it has Kylie it has the controversial lip with the lipstick drooping because I think another artist on Instagram said that she did this first blah 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 but like I've said Kylie has how many 60 million followers so uh, yeah we did not know about you. We just knew it from Kylie. Kylie, whether Kylie stole it or not, who's to know? I don't spread rumors. I'm just telling you what's happening. In the back, it has Kylie XOXO, which I thought was very, very cute. And it has the Kylie tips. Line the lips with the lip liner and fill the lips in with the liquid lip color. Let me pause. Of course, you should line the lips for any lipstick that you have or liquid lipstick. But you know what I do? This is where I kiss in the inside of my mouth. This is where I eat. This is where I drink. This is where I talk. All of the lipstick here wears off over time and I always have like a ring outside my mouth or on the outside of my mouth. It doesn't stay without lining the lip as well. So guys, as she says, you know, line your lips, I'm gonna give you a little extra, line the whole mouth for staying power. And that's just what I do, and that's how my own lipstick. Okay, so we're moving further down. She has it also in another language. I think it is French. And then she has matte liquid lipstick, and then she tells you the ingredients, and of course the liner, blah, blah, blah. Woodland Hills, California, 91364 zip code, kaliecosmetics.com. Girlfriend, I am so proud of you, Kylie. I really am. You did your thing, and it is, it is hotter than anything I know honest to God. Bring out more colors and let me see. Maybe I'll get here and there. But you know what? I have to give credit where credit is due. This is a rare color. I have not seen anybody do the number 22. It is simply adorable. It comes with a liquid lipstick and it comes with a pencil. Let me show you here. There you go. I've taken them out of the box, saving time here. So this is the liquid lipstick. This is number 22. It dropped in my hand. This is the liquid lipstick and it's called number 22. Apparently it's Kylie's uh, favorite number. I love number 22 because it's Ula's birthday day. Yes, he was born June the 22nd year. I, I don't remember. <laughs> Okay, anyway, this is it here. So this is the 22 and then this is the pencil that it comes with. It retails for $29. After seeing that, I looked into the box and I said to myself, yes, we got the liquid lipstick bottle. Yes, we got the lip pencil. Um, where's the information for the doctor that gave you your lip injections? That's a complete kit. Because we know what you look like before Kylie would be the full lip kit. The doctor's information for the plump, 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 the liquid lipstick bottle, and the lip pencil. So for $29, uh, 
Is it a good price? Well, mm. no, I have, like I said, I haven't seen anything like this. But I have Anastasia Beverly Hills. I have two other hot orange colors. It's not so much a dupe, but I just want to show you how original this Kylie 22 is to me. I'm sure some of you will say, uh uh uh, yeah, Milani has this color, that color. I, this is all that I have, and I don't have anything in comparison to 22. What I do have, which is kind of sort of close, is Persimmon by Anastasia Beverly Hills and Spicy also by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I've never ever owned anything close to 22. No, I really haven't. So I'm gonna swatch for you, my loves, okay? So I'm gonna swatch Lip Kit Kylie for you first. For me, you know, when you're asking me what does uh, 22 Lip Kit Kylie look like, she describes it as an orange red. For me, on my complexion, it just reminds me of cinnamon. It reminds me of cinnamon, it reminds me of spice. It reminds me of a very, um, it's, you know what? I would have called it Sahara, or I'd have called it desert. You know, because it's got that rich red, deserty color. And this is what it looks like here. See? There you go. I don't know. Can, there you go. Can you see? So for me, it, it's more of a brownie red or a brownie orange. There you go. It's more of like of a brownie orange-esque. And I love it. Okay. So let me go now. And this is Persimmon by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm going to put that. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not even close. This is like a fire orange. There you go. Can you see? It is not at all anything close. There, okay. And then we have Spicy, also by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And this is even hotter than the other. Oh, look at it. So you can see it is, no, you know, 22 is the coolest. And I think that's why I love it because it's an everyday color without it being too much. I just think, oh, adorable. It's a fabulous color. It's what I have on now. It complements, you know, it complements me. I get compliments all the time. They always ask me, what color are you wearing? That's so pretty, what color are you wearing? And I'm like, Lip Kit Kylie, 22, yes. do like it's very different from the others that you have you know from everything that I have seen and I think it's a gorgeous complementary color it comes off very hot on lighter complexions but I'm dark and this is another reason why I thought you know what do an episode on just the one lip just for you to really see what it looks like on a dark girl you know mm, mm, mm. Okay. okay darling so that is enough talking I have the number 22 on and I'm going to take it off a lot of you have asked how do you take off liquid lipsticks the easiest way is to take a little uh, puff puff little little cotton board my lovely gorgeous baby oil and it breaks the liquid lipstick right down so that's what I do okay so I'm going to demonstrate it for you and that's it you see it just comes right off. And it's nothing to it. Here's the Lip Kit Kylie pencil. This is the 22. You guys, you can sharpen this. You can sharpen this. Just put it in and you sharpen. And there you have it. What I do is that I take the MAC. I take the MAC, uh, what's this? Chestnut. Chestnut lip pencil and I line my lips. I'm a dark girl. I need to, you know, really give it some shape and just some, some, you know, some oomph. So I line my lips with chestnut and this is MAC, yeah? Okay. So after doing that, I now now use the the lip kit 22 on the inside, yeah, and that gives it a lot of sting, huh? Uh, 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 uh. Um, how does it feel? It feels soft. It feels smooth. I like the texture of the pencil. It's not that soft. I like the fact that. Um, it goes right over my lips and it doesn't tug. It doesn't pull too much, you know. So I like that. How does it smell? A lot of you have also asked. It smells like, it smells like ice cream. 
It smells like vanilla. Yeah, it smells like vanilla. That's that is what it smells like. So it's very sweet smelling. That's cute. That's cute. Mm. And then we're going to go in with the lip kit, Kylie number twenty-two. And this is what it looks like on a dark girl. Think um, Naomi Campbell. Think Naomi Campbell. Think um, who else is darkish? Oh. Thinky man. Thinky man. As it's drying, what I do is just to give it a little oomph, I will take the Anastasia Beverly Hills Pure Hollywood Liquid Lipstick, I put a little bit onto the brush and just dab. And that way you get uh, like, a, like, a, like a little ombre, not too much, but just to give it a little oomph, yeah? So let me just put it onto my brush. I just dab it right there. I just give it a little something just to give it that little oomph and there you have it. I love this color. I think it's so pretty. I think it is so feminine. I just think, ah, oh, you know what? It's just such a lovely pick-me-up everyday kind of color that you can wear to work, that you can wear out. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. I think it's like desert. I consider it desert. I consider it very much like, um, Sahara. That's what I would have called it, I guess, because I'm African, I can relate to that in a sense. And then when I went to Dubai, when we went to the desert, this color, you know, was what I saw out there, you know. And I just think it's so very pretty. For dark complexion girls, get the 22 and make it fun and enjoy it. So this is what I do. I can wear it plain. I put a little bit of pure Hollywood Anastasia Beverly Hills. And then if I really want to be Zsa and I want to go out at night and I want to give it even more, I will add gloss on top of it. Yes, I will. And it turns into this beautiful moisturizing lipstick-esque look. Beautiful. And it stays on all day and it doesn't build at the edges of your mouth. Of all her um, uh, colors, I loved this. I absolutely love this. With any liquid lipstick, you can make it work. You can make it work to your complexion. You add, you minus, you blend, you this. But this is, this, this is, this is gorgeous. Totally love it. All right, my loves. That is it. I hope you enjoyed the little sweet episode and uh, the quote of the week after the episode. And the quote of the week is, when there's no enemy within, the enemies outside cannot hurt you. And that is absolutely correct. 90% of the time, our enemies, our demons is from inside. When you clear all of those inner demons and your insecurities about this and what people say and what this, then you are free. You are free and you are empowered and you know yourself. So when somebody says something about you, you can ignore it, which I do, laugh over it because you know who you are and they don't. So why do you care what they say? So cleanse yourself from within. Okay, darlings? I'll see you next week. Oh, yes, for, I forgot to tell you guys. Follow me on Snapchat. Yes, I am Snapchat addicted. <laughs> Fumi de Salo Vold 1. Yes, my loves, the one and only. Follow me on Snapchat. Let us have fun. Let's connect. And then just see the, us, you know, the other side of my life and what I do with Ula.
I've seen sorrow 